Hi guys, it's me Tiffany, and I just wanted to give you an update on my pawpaws. Here's my row of pawpaws. You can see that they are actively leafing out. Hi guys, it's me Tiffany, and so I just came to let you know the pawpaw trees are doing just fine. You can see that they have pawpaws on them. Something that I did not do that I have done in the past is I did not spend a lot of time hand pollinating. And the reason why is because I have been getting far more pawpaws than I can ever eat. You can see they are so beautiful. It's awesome to get under the canopy. It's so peaceful under here and you can see the fruit hanging against the backdrop of the leaves. Here's a tree that's laden with fruit. This tree is always laden with fruit for whatever reason. You can see the pawpaws hanging everywhere. This is my youngest and skittiest tree. And even so, she has some fruit on her. She would have had more had I bothered to pollinate. But So if you've been watching my pawpaw videos, if you remember, I had two sections of pawpaws. One was over here in my shaded section. There used to be a pawpaw over here, over there, and one standing kind of right here near the building. I cut all of those down. The only one left is this one here. And honestly, I don't really know why I didn't cut this down. Um, the fruit on this one's not great, but I guess if I had to say the reason why I didn't cut this one down, um, is this tree has always given me flowers and pollen right when I needed it. So she's still here. I don't promise that I will leave her here forever, but for right now, she's been kind of old, reliable, old, faithful, old, dependable. And for right now, I'm going to leave her where she stands. So that's it, guys. That's an update on my pawpaws. Have a great day. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.